quick kitchen tip. If you have a cupcake or individual desserts to make, these can become your best friend, especially if you've got to transport them a long distance. Even, well, okay, transporting them any distance from your home or your business to somewhere else can take a toll. So, this has two uses. You can make individual three-layer cakes. This one happens to be chocolate or single serve cupcake containers. So for one purpose you do it this way. The other purpose you do it this way. This happens to be a 9 ounce sundae container with lid. And I am so glad I found that particular blog post Otherwise, I would have spent a great deal of money on individual cupcake can, uh, clamshells. These, a lot cheaper. They do the job. They give a quite a unique presentation. You can see that. And it gives you nice height so that you can load up the top of that cupcake all you want. Or, they give the most fantastic three-layer cakes. And you can even decorate the top. Happy baking! Here's another quick kitchen tip. We have been asked by people who come to the kitchen, to my kitchen, to what do I do with extra cake? Well, we make parfaits, or we eat it, or <laughs> you can turn this into a trifle. And again, nice little sundae cup that has the vanilla vegan cake and the chocolate vegan cake all soy free that we were making today with um, icing that's also vegan and soy free this really odd chocolate ganache with coconut cream that we were making today and you just make them up and magically you have dessert for your family or if you have people that don't really care and would like a new taste experience, suddenly you have a little cake parfait dessert to sell. You could dress this up with fresh fruit after you take the lid off. This is something that you could even do for a dinner party. It would be a simple matter of using ramekins maybe or your fancy little glass cut, um, cut glass bowls and just have a bit of fun. Use the left, you could even just use a cake that didn't turn out very well. You could use a cake that uh, got a little too toasty on the bottom and you think, oh my gosh, what am I going to do? Well, guess what? You take a serrated knife, you start chopping off the parts that either overcooked or didn't cook, and what's left, it lo it's going to look like a mess and you're going to go, no, my perfect cake. Well, guess what? Anything like that can be repurposed into something like this. So, you could put fresh berries, you could put a berry compote, you could put jam, you could make a coconut cream with coconut flaked coconut to go in between. If you can manage dairy and eggs and things of that nature, you could put pudding in between it. You could make custard and put it between it. You could combination fresh fruit and custard or pudding or something. The possibilities are only limited to the scope of your imagination. So have a bit of fun.